Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Total War Rome 2 as the Egyptians. So we are currently dealing with some confusion and some annoyance and some updates. Um, patches that is. Um, most importantly the patch that makes the, the AI slightly less retarded. They will no longer just blindly run into my pike units and that's causing a lot of problems for my armies as it makes it so that I actually have to get some um, some units to protect my flanks. So how about we get that? How much do they cost? Upkeep. 300. Ugh. Why are you so expensive? I need it. Uh, probably I should have waited until the next turn, but oh well. There you go. That's my solution to the new patch. <laughs> uh, yeah, that should, that, yeah, that should be fine. And holy shit, the people of Hellas is happy. Or are happy. I guess it's because they have two two temples and one agora. Or amphitheatron. Something like that. Uh, other issues we're dealing with is the fact that I need more food. I have so far in this campaign just not thought about food at all because I've always had enough. But now it has reached a point where I don't have enough food anymore and I will have to start upgrading my... I'll have to start building more farms I guess. I mean there's a bunch of these buildings out there. For example, this one. Why? Oh, I'm currently tearing this one down, so once that, once that's killed, I can start building a farm there instead. And I should probably be working on converting some of my current farms to some more efficient ones. Like, I'm, I'm gonna take two turns to turn this into a farm. Reasoning being that this gives more wealth, but less food. And this gives more food, but less wealth. So, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And that's all I can do for this turn. So that should hopefully get our food back in... Or get the food situation back under control. We still are not taking any penalties for having no food, but... That might change very soon. So, yep, let's go ahead and end the turn and uh, see if we can get some stuff done. Hello and welcome to another turn. The faction of Tribali has been destroyed and that's... Something rather interesting because the Tribali is an important faction to, our, faction to us simply because they are... Treat, yeah, I feel like these pictures are new. Are they updated as well? I don't think these used to be this way. But here we go. The um, the Odrysian kingdom has conquered my or has conquered the Tribali, and these guys are sort of threatening my border. I'm not sure if they're actually doing that or if it's just what I think they're doing. But there's something also very very interesting. You can see how the uh, people of Cyprus are actually. They're doing something. I mean, they have an army outside. I mean, ready to attack this place. And I, I'm no, 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 no. I can't let that happen. I must get in here before they do, because ah, uh, because if they take this, then, then they will own it from what I, from what I understand. And that's a problem because then I'll have to, in order to get it, then I'll have to, I'll have to attack these guys, and I don't really want to do that, because you know they're my satrapy. So let's try and use the fact, though, that they are here and go ahead and lay siege to the to the city. So something like that. We haven't fully replenished quite yet, but uh, yeah, there we go. This is kind of what I wanted. You can see that we are we getting reinforcements from all of these guys, so we should be able to just go ahead and auto resolve this remaining force. Seventy-five percent. If we do a balanced no. Close victory. Wow. Interesting what it. Your general's predictions. So, how about we do a protect. Ah, uh, none of these actually matters. Let's do a balanced one. Shove some swords through their stomachs and leave it at that. The reason why I did. Uh, I auto resolved this rather than fighting it was I'm, I wanted to make sure these guys actually took some damage and my elephants just died. That's like. Ah. Uh, that's like a thing. You can see a lot of them took damage, so that's very good. It's not very good, but it's better than me, my actual army, losing men, you know. That's like a thing. Like, elephants just, in general, they just die whenever you, um... Uh, whenever you, um... Uh, Imperium! Yeah, but, um... <laughs> elephants, they, that, that's like a rule. Elephants always die when you auto-resolve. That's like, that always happens. Uh, but yeah. We can now field nine armies, nine, six fleets. I mean, there's no way I, I'm not doing that already. So, or like I'm, I'm not going to do that. So to be honest, it's fine. 
and get more edicts, uh, more agents, and we are an impressive empire now. How nice. Because, well, the exact reason is unknown to me, so... But yeah, here's the thing, though. I think I might want to take this army and march it back. Because these guys are threatening my border. Like, really... Because I, I want them to mo move away and go, some, go, go somewhere else and bother someone else before I... Before anything else happens. Before I start moving into Thrace and start thinking about conquering that. So I'm going to move back. Shouldn't, shouldn't need to stress the um, conquest so badly. So, so what? That's a part of Illyria, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, so now we, I th yeah, we pretty much have firm control now all over all of Greece. It's pretty cool. Um, I guess at this point, only this part was actually regarded as Greece. You know, this part and all of these islands. You know, a little bit over here. Greece was a little bit all over the place. Maps were a little bit more hardcore back in the day. Uh, so what's the culture up here? 100% Hellenic, so no problem. No issue over here. We could go and get a skirmisher camp. I would prefer not to have that. So let's go and convert it to one of those buildings instead. And let's get a, a food. At least something that does not take away food. Like this ISIS thing here. Let's get that. That should get this city nice and going. You know, should should get that city going. Okay, so food situation is stabilizing. That's good. So we can go ahead and build something here. I want to get in, go ahead and oh, growth and public order. Or no, nah, I have enough wealth. I think growth would be nice. Let's go ahead and get some growth. No, we already actually have that. Water. Yeah, no, we actually have one of those buildings. So let's not get that. Let's get a agora instead. And here we can build some farms. Because I need food, so that my people can eat. Because if you don't eat, bad things happen to you, and I don't think I need to make that so clear. But there you go. And now this army here. Can you? Can I recruit troops now? I can. So I guess it was because I. Uh, I guess it was because they were in um, uh, double time. That was basically what was causing that. So let's go ahead and uh, recruit a navy. Let's get some catapults because because badass and some towers. And a light artillery ship. I guess these other ones kind of serve the same purpose. This one has more range, though. And you have to take another turn to build it. Nah, fuck it then. Fuck it. 19 ships it is. I don't, do I don't want to build anymore. I'm lazy. Uh, but here's the thing, though. Like, uh, The question is, could I convince these people to conquer these people? Because if I could, that would be very good, because I want them to do that. Because I'm not planning conquering this place myself, so if I could make other people do it for me, that would be most wanted. question is, though, I, I think... I, I At least I want to have some sort of army going on in this region before I do that. Uh, and this region is not 100% Hellenic. What's that all about? Uh, desert nomadic is, you know, I guess it is slowly becoming Hellenic, it's just, it takes some time. I thought that was, like, done for ages ago. I guess not. Oh, well, that's fine. It's fine. Let's, um, get something done then. I think, I don't think there's too much we can do that's in this turn now. I'm gonna go ahead and disband this army right here. Or not. I guess I need to disband all these other units first. It's simply because I don't need an, I don't need this army. This army was purely here to defend from a random little force of, uh, you know, the people who used to own these two areas that was standing in the mountains. It was just a sort of a defense, but now they are gone. They were actually killed by Cypress here. So, they still have this uh, champion, though. So let's go in and get rid of him. We can try and get rid of him. Uh, oh, wow, that's not very likely at all. Oh, wow, okay. Nah, nah, you know what? Let's just not do that. You know, that's fine. I, live to serve Aaron. I, want, I want him to do something, though. So, I mean, could we... Shit, I don't know. Go spy on someone. Go spy on these people. Cause problems. Like, poison them and shit. I will come poison all of them. Darkness. Right faster! Go, 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 go! Nice! Of course, this might have been a bad decision. Holy fuck, a lot of them died. I don't know if that was only my guy, but if it was, holy shit! I killed like a gajillion of those guys. Wow, okay, I'm... I can... Uh, yeah, okay. 
That's that's acceptable. Let's go ahead and get rid of these mercenaries. They're expensive and I don't really need them. Instead, I should be focusing on getting some actual troops. Let's get some... Um, let's get some royal peltasts. Are you ready to serve? I hope you are, because if you do not serve the pharaoh good, then I will personally execute you with... with pain and shit. Yeah. Yeah. You better not mess... Oh, still only 19? Okay, we can get one more units. Let's get some elephants! Yay, elephants! But I thought you could only recruit elephants in regions that actually have elephants in them. I cannot see any elephants around here. Maybe it's enough that you only ha that you actually have elephants in your empire. Uh, I don't know. I I really don't know. Whatever, it's fine. Leave it at this. And we have run out of money and run out of stuff to do. So how about we end another turn and I can issue an edict. Let's issue an edict then. Maybe one here. Let's get one. Uh, mercenary? No. Building? No. No. Food. Holy crap! 15 public order? Whoa, okay, that escalated. Uh, sure, that sounds fun. The public order here is okay. Uh, but I guess we want to get it up to 100 as quick as possible. Why not? So, uh, yeah, that's... Oh, they might actually sail for this city now. Hmm. Maybe raising a force here might not be that bad of an idea then. Let's go ahead and do that, actually. Just go and raise that army. It's, it's you know, it doesn't actually cost anything, so I mean, why the hell? I mean, I might as well do it. Let's get some Galatians. Ready for orders. And go there. Set up the watch. And defend the city or whatever. Yeah. Why not get a free unit? That's what I say. Makes sense. Okay, that's this turn, so let's go ahead and end it. And uh, the next turn, we I'm considering whether or not I want to um, build a uh, another army down in uh, like uh, Judea or whatever you want to call it, Palestine, whatever you know, place with the Jerusalem in it. I don't I, I don't know whether or not I want to do that. I'm thinking uh, I might want to I'm gonna, might want to rebuild my other armies before I do that, but we'll have to wait and see. Okay, uh, so the Macedonians have landed some derps on our land, and there's nothing I can really do about that right now, so, oh well. Some herpaderp. Yeah, these uh, champions of mine, they are just going crazy when it comes to ra ranking up. Trespasser. Oh yeah, it's the... Um, I, should, I should be paying attention to this. Opportune failed. Your agents... Ah, uh, so much agent crap that I don't know about. I should be doing something. Like, this girl right here, can you do anything? Can you, like, is there anything you can do? Disruption. Undermine authority. No, that's totally useless. Assassination. Well, that's, that's just not gonna happen, so... Yeah, it's good that you live to serve Pharaoh and all that. I guess you can go up here and cause him happiness. I cannot do that, my lord. She cannot do that, my lord. Why not? Very easy. Just go right there. Can she not go into cities? That is impossible, my lord. So they cannot go into cities. I cannot do that, my lord. Or have I misunderstood something? I shall see to the needs of the children of the Nile. Administration. Advise local officials that by increasing tax rate, protect local settlement against the authorities. Blah, blah, blah. This agent is not deployed here. Can she go into cities I am now? Sorry, my lord. I cannot. Now you can't do anything. I, Sh I don't understand us. those agents. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, can I assist, I'm always not regretting taking I this know. army up here, but I kind of didn't have much of a choice, did I now? So, God knows what the people of Cyprus are going to be doing now, as these guys... I'm not fighting the Adrian Kingdom. I'm not at war with any of those n these northerners right now. Currently only fighting these guys, and they're, they're rebels over there, so that's why I'm currently at war with them. Other than that, I think I'm at peace with pretty much everyone. Some of these, but I mean, the, the ones, at least the ones I'm fighting right now are people who, strictly speaking, are not factions anymore. They just, or they have at least lost, they have at least lost all their cities. Let's bring this guy down here and see if we can cause some problems. If we kill their general, will they will be able to, ask, uh, no, no, we won't, it's not even possible to do that, so. Um, let's do... 
undiscovered army. That's totally useless. Let's go ahead and poison them. What the hell? Might as well poison them a little bit. You failed. Didn't increase in rank though, so... That's something. More authority. Manipulation. Sure. Why not? Eh. Oh man, so many of these enemy derps roaming the lands. I do not like it. I do have a navy though, ready to deal with that little issue of ours. So let's get that navy going. I can actually recruit troops a while at sea, so why don't we do that? Let's get some of those. Let's get some of that. The one side. So you can sail over here. You should really go into double stance. I don't know why I did that. Why I didn't do that before? Oh well. Whenever you cross these open oceans, there's no real reason to not do that, you know. In the meantime, I guess we could do some recruitment. I'm thinking um, we need to rebuild this army, and we also need to rebuild this army with up basically upgrade the armies. Is it? Uh, I don't know. If, uh, I don't know how necessary it is. It would take. We can. I can. We can do. Th can we do three units at once? Uh, just. I don't know, upgrade something, whatever, doesn't matter. Um, okay. Let's think some strategy here. So, they're not even that more, much more expensive, but they're better though. Quite clearly so. So how many... So we can do three... We can do three units per turn. That's... Um, to replace all this shit then, then we would want to need... We need mm, three turns to rebuild this army, to bring that back up to strength, and we would need uh, same amount. Both of them have nine pikemen in each army. I think I'm not going to bother replacing anything else, especially until I can get some better cav. Yeah, citizen. You know these. Yeah, they both have citizen cav in the, in the armies. So uh, and the general is for some reason. No, it's he's a Potelemaic cav. We can't build Potelemaic. Right now, this is m missile cast. I don't want that. So no, I don't think. Um, no, we can't build Potalamek quite yet. So I'm gonna wait for that, and instead I'm gonna start the rebuilding of uh, this army right here. I mean, we might as well do something, right? So let's go ahead and get rid of some of these units. Start out by doing three of them. So combined, it would have to take six turns before we could rebuild our armies. I guess we don't we don't, we don't need to get all, go all the way out, but we could at least do something. So you can just chill there, that's fine. How can I assist, Pharaoh? This army right here, though, what am I gonna do with that? I don't know whether or not these this navy here is gonna be able to do anything. Can't say for sure. Oh well, let's just let it be. Uh, I still have a bunch of money though, and I can't. No, I I know what I know what to do. We can keep. We can upgrade this can army. I can like recruit units here and just send them up north. We can do like that. So that should work. So let's do that actually. No, we can't because we can't recruit any more units in this. Because we can't recruit any more units in this spe spe specific region, and we still have a bunch of money that we need to spend. So I think it's time to uh, raise another army. Actually, I think it's time. Look at all these cities: Palmyra, Dura, all those cities. I want to conquer them all. Of course, invading the cells is quite the risky thing, as you would have to. I would have to then go into conflict with a bunch of these factions. They have a lot of satrapies. A bunch of these Easterners would have to. We had. We'd have to go to war with a bunch of these people then. Media. Drangi. Drangi na. Okay. Um. Media. You know what? I think I'm actually going to postpone it. I think I'm just going to do that. Yeah. Uh, and then, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, nah, 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 yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go ahead and wait. Be patient and all that, you know. We could just straight away go in for an attack over here, and we also need to recruit another unit, as this unit, this army isn't fill, filled up, and holy crap, we can, like, recruit nothing good here. Oh, crap. Um. I guess we could get rid of some of these skirmishers. Replace them with some better ones. Like so. And someone here needs to get improved, so 
do that. Um, I know I'm not paying too much attention here, but that's just how things are going to have to be right now, I guess. I uh, could raise a navy, though. That might be a good idea. Raising another navy is... should be legitimate. Uh, can we, if we go into economy, can we, like, see specifically what... Uh, like how much each army takes. No, we cannot. Okay, then. Maybe we should lower some taxes. No, that's only good for happiness. It doesn't cause any growth. I, I can, I, like, the happiness situation is fine right now, so... I'm just gonna keep it at medium, that's fine. Uh, yeah, because maybe raising a fleet right here would be a good thing. I'm thinking that might be good. Uh, yeah. That could help out the situation up here. Nah, you know what, I'm just gonna ditch it. I think we should be fine just fielding an army up there. And I'll, I'll raise a fleet if I need it. Mm, I guess we should spend our rest... I guess we could just spend the rest of our money on building shit then. Here's what I'm gonna do though. I'm going to... So, the Kingdom of the Herpaderps. These guys are... I'm sorry for not doing much, I'm just thinking a lot. But that's part of the game, I guess. So, what do you... Yeah, so they own this part, and Tylus own this part. So, it's kind of... A, yeah, I think we are better off taking down these guys first. I, I think. They do have a navy here, though, which is an issue, to say the least. Um, they can cause some problems if we don't... Be, if we're not careful about it all. Ah, shit, I need to get my navy up here then, if I want to do that. Well... My lord. We could just travel by sea and try to knock them out with my navy itself. But no. I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of these guys, and I'm gonna move up to the borders. So at least we'll be, we'll be ready. And then I'll recruit these... And then I'll recruit the units. Our lord needs good fighters. Uh, yeah, that should work. Mm, now let's spend the rest of our money on upgrades. Why not? That's fine there. Can I upgrade anything at all? Now. I don't think I can, so... Uh, let's not do it then. Could convert this one. No, I cannot. Okay, never mind. Anything over here, maybe? Yep, there's some farms. Let's go and build some farms. And that'll be that. Let's end the turn. And see if anything interesting happens. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Yeah, that's the sound of me being worried about the situation. Oh shit. Oh well, we got a battle in front of us then. Uh so that's the yeah, that's the guys we crushed and now they're coming in for some revenge. We'll have to what really are they attacking from both land? Ah oh, they're actually gaining support from the Macedonians because they're allied. Wow, that's pretty cool. They're they're sort of it's sort of a combined land and sea assault thingy going on here. Ooh, fancy. We we'll actually have some boats on their own here. Let's, you know, no, not interested. Um, kind of annoying that you can't just deploy them straight away onto land, but I guess that's fair. All right, uh, let's just deploy in like the center and just bar barricade the city center and just like make sure we can defend this place. And please, can you? Ah, uh, I hate that new function so much. I just. Look at that! I can't get over how annoying this is. Like, if you do this, then you just... Just dragging your guys around crap. That's so incredibly annoying. I hate it. I hate it with passion. Like, I wish there was ways you could, like, turn these things on and off. In the same way that you... You should be able to, like, turn off... Like, back, back... Back whenever you like, whenever you try to stretch your units around, they would actually be sort of a a 3D model where there is now just yellow dots. That should be a thing you should be allowed to just turn on and off depending on what you prefer, and not something that's just there, you know. Oh crap! That was a shitty decision. Eh, it wasn't really a shitty decision. It was just more. It was it was really just me derping. That's fine, you know. It's usual. 
infantry. Uh, go over there in the center, and some of you guys there. Battle ready and eager. Can they move through here? It's not. It's not possible. Well, I guess I'll. I'll use a. I use a mob to figure that one out. No, they cannot go there. Okay, good. All right, go to shore. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Well, it's a little bit weird. Can't you just like go there or something like that? You really have to. Oh, okay. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. If that's what you want to do, then I'm not going to stop you. So where's the enemy? Here's the enemy. Let's go ahead and speed the game up. I know I usually edit the way this part, and it's actually quite a surprise how much of the battle actually is just me, you know, waiting for the actual battle to start. You know. Uh, that's all. That, that at least that's something I notice whenever I, uh, which for some reason can't see the dots. They're sort of covered in this stuff. It's weird. Uh, whatever. Uh, I usually see that these sort of, and you know, whenever you just sit around and just wait for the enemy to come to you, that's usually one of the most time-consuming things in the game. So, where are the enemy units? Oh, for some reason they want to sail all the way around. Sure. I really wish I had some cavalry, and I'm getting shot. Luckily, they're shooting some useless units. Are they really shooting me from all the way over here? Or have I missed something? Ah, I'm sure they have one of those uh, hardcore boats which can like shoot from a distance or something like that. Let's take a look at that, see if we can find it. Or maybe the Macedonians have artillery? I do not know who is shooting me. Confused Green Force is confused. I'll just hold, hold my ground. Hold, hold the ground, men. Okay, this is gonna be interesting, to say the least. <laughs> I really wish they would attack me in waves rather than just all at once. But of course, all at once is the best strategic decision. So it wouldn't surprise me if that's what they did. For some reason, instead of going in here, they're going around. Okay. I wonder how many men my Galatians are going to kill, because they are super hardcore parkour elite. I mean, look at these guys. They're pretty damn badass. Oh yeah. Epic mustache is epic. Um, who the hell tore these buildings down? I don't understand. Here they are, trying to come up with some... I don't know what they're doing. Just kind of running around trying to figure out what to do. So it's like they're just both the both of the armies are sort of, are sort of trying to act as one, trying to just blob together and attack from one front. No, here's the other. I don't know how did these guys get all over all the way over here. That makes no sense. So they're blocking the street. I do not understand why, but uh, they are. So, yeah. I'm guessing they're waiting for these guys to come, so... Oh, here's some enemies though, and they are Axemen, which means they are Slingers, I believe. So let's go to... or... They're, I think they're Spear Throwers. Let's get our, our own skirmishes up there. They're at least very light troops, so... Should be able to just bombard them with some... Some Spears, and that should kill them. Oh! And throwing shit at my General. At least face them to minimize losses and uh, do a shield wall. I don't know if that actually increases defense, but it sounds like it should. These guys are not dying. And if they are, they're dying very slowly. Let's go ahead and get some firing missiles on our own then. See if that helps things. I feel like this is not particularly efficient. Uh, something is happening. Seems like they're all attacking from this one direction, so I'm gonna go. I'm going to go in and take these guys. I'm gonna move them up here. Supports. Yeah, that makes sense. And the mob can group up and sort of just stand in the middle of all. Just die with honor. That's their. That's the only really thing I expect them to achieve. Here they come. Charging into my pikes. Good, good. Come on, pikemen. I know you're shitty quality and all that, but still, do your job. 
guys are legitimately bombarding me. A bunch of these slaves, just slaving about. Let's get a charge going. Because they don't seem to be doing a lot here. Oh, some like Axemen. No, shit, didn't mean to- No, didn't mean to- No, no! Ay, 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 ay. Now that happens again. I hate that new function. I hate it. hate it so much. I want to select the units. Thank you. I want to kill these guys. Slave javelin men shouldn't really be too much. Should be rather easy to kill, even even with my shitty Egyptian units. Yeah, cheering and shit. Yeah, the AI might have gotten some updates, but they're still stupid. <laughs> I mean, what is this? They're like, oh yeah, man, we're so smart. We're like blocking the streets and crap. Holy shit, we're intelligent. Oh man, I'm so proud of myself. Arr. Now they're blocking. I don't know what they're doing. Kind of blocking this place, I guess? But, I don't know. At least they do what I wanted them to do. They're attacking me in waves rather than attacking all at once. Stop them from shooting here, as they are shooting my own dudes. I don't want them to do that, so... This is rather easy. What's this whip thing, by the way, that I clicked back? Hey, there's actually a recharge now. Only that it actually recharges... <laughs> it actually recharges before it go runs out, so yeah, I have a feeling that might not be intended. Oh crap, they actually sent some citizens in. We should still be fine, we have rather superior numbers, so I'm still confident in my swordsman abilities to be awesome and sit. And sit! No, and shit. Speed up, speed the game up a little bit. There you go. They're not routing, but they're at least running away, which is kind of accomplishes the same thing, you know. I have a feeling this battle is going to last forever. Yeah, this episode is going to be unintentionally long. Fuck, I I sat down tonight and I wanted to make a few episodes so that I could upload regularly to in this week. But this is what I get instead. I have no idea if my infantry can kill these... If, if they can kill these cav units. Because I know these cav units are high quality than mine, but, you know... I guess we should help them a little bit. Let's charge the Galatians in there. Maybe that'll convince someone. No, yeah, they're dying pretty badly. Let's get back, actually. Uh, you gotta love the, these guys. Like, huh? Hey, what? No, we're not gonna do anything. We're just gonna stand here. Just fuck you. Oh, here we go. Glorious, <laughs> glorious suicide charge. And I. It's not only cav units that have like problems with running away. So does infantry, it seems. Well, good thing. Now, now we know. Let's throw some spears at these guys. In my, from my experience, throwing spears at Cav is like not. It usually just doesn't do anything at all. But oh wow, that's actually a pretty good charge. Yeah, wow, my guys are actually wavering. Oh, there we go. Here's some guys coming in, and they're faced with some spears. And they're like, no, fuck the shit, that was a bad idea, I regret, I regret my decisions. Oh, they brought some more slaves up. Nice. More slaves to kill. Sad though, I should be freeing the slaves and, you know. You know, I shouldn't be freeing them, I should be putting them to work. In my own empire. And that's going to be work that does not involve throwing flaming shit at my guys. Oh, that's an issue. Crap. Oh. Go, Suicide Charge! Go! Well, the AI has learned to, um, to use... The AI has learned... Uh, it, uh, the AI is a lot better now to outflank, but when, they, when, it's not, uh, when it's not possible to outflank, they're still equally stupid. Second win... Warcry! Rawr! Come on, fight! Kill them before they throw more flaming crap at me. I don't like the. I don't, I don't like it when they do that. Have these guys taken any? Yeah, one Galatian have died so far. It's pretty impressive. Are these guys? No, they're just javelins. So it's interesting that they're actually able to hold their own ground. They should just like evaporate the second I move my guys in. 
That's maybe overdoing it a little bit, but yeah. So this should just make stuff better, but it makes them tired. I guess whipping people is kind of tiring. I don't have any experience yet with it though, so I don't know. I have enslaved a bunch of people in my campaign so far, but this is total war, not total slavery, so... It's not like a slave simulator or anything like that, so... Wow, these... The guys have actually killed two of my, um... Oh crap, there's the enemy army. Let's try and run back then. Go, 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 go! I don't want to get my guys caught in front of my defensive line when the actual enemy army is coming up. I got up there like, ah, don't run away. Go 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 go! Don't stop! Don't stop! Run! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! Go back the line! Go back behind the line! Okay, I'll stand back here and brace for charge. Oh shit! Now they're bringing in more of these spear fuckers. Damn it! Stupid peltast! I wish. Oh man, I wish I had some cavalry right now. That would have helped out the situation. I should have made my general a cav general instead. This is not working out very well for me. My guys are just literally burning up. Damn it! And now they have actual units there to defend them. Come on, chase. For Egypt, suicide! Go 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 go! Suicide mob! Suicide! Char! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Stop them from throwing! Come on! Go go go! And that actually worked! They're actually running away! The mercenary veteran hoplites are running away from my fucking mob. Wow. Shit then, if that's how it's gonna be, then let's charge into more mob. Go! Mob! Or don't, no, don't, don't do that. Go around here instead if you're gonna go anywhere. I said, go over there and you stop. No, that, no, 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 okay, you're dead. Yep, you're dead. You just no what no I did not click that I did not click that what is happening here get back into the line thank you oh shit well I'll see that okay keep the line hold the line the line oh my god the line oh shit oh the mob failed that's understandable there's a reason why they're called mob. Yeah, these guys are actually... Oh, here we go. Suicide. Yes. Go, suicide. Arr! Oh, more suicide. 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 <laughs> wow, they actually pushed through my line a little bit. They did pretty much kill themselves in the process, but... Well, that's understandable. They are companion cav, after all. Oh, there we go. Okay, here we go. Now we're talking. That's mercenary veterans. Let's get our... Um, Oh, nice! Let's get them, um, um, Galatians sort of behind the line to kill them if they try anything stupid. And you guys, yeah, they're, they've already activated that ability, so let's go into my general and do second win? No, inspire, inspire the, um, inspire my pikes. And war cry on that guy. And second win on that guy. Just boost their morale like crazy. Hey, it is actually working, kind of. I mean, they're the AI isn't very smart with its with its movement. It's sort of just walking back and forth, allowing me to spear it. But still, all right, all right. Yeah, this seems to be going my way. I think we got this. We held the line. Let the future generations know that we did hold the line. Oh, here they come again. We are ready. We are ready to meet them. There we go. Nice, nice. The issue is when they start pushing into your lines. That's when the problems begin. So the second I start seeing this line properly just falling apart, that's when I'm going to push in my Galatians. And I'm thinking we're closing in on that moment right now. Nope, they're, they're going back. Okay, good. Now they're bringing in some Peltasts. Uh, yeah, I think that's they, that's that's all the units they got. They're pretty much done now. 
So yeah, once my guys kill... Ah, oh, shit. Okay, now it's time. Go, go, go. Push, push. Kill. Kill them all. Yeah, my line is now legitimately falling a little bit apart. So let's try and get back here. Try and reinforce this line a little bit. Faster. Oh, no, there we go. Now they're dying. Yep, they died. They died. Oh, yeah. Victory! Sweet! Uh, that worked out, so, um, yeah. Uh, so how many... <laughs> it's kind of like you, whenever, after such a battle, you kind of expect there to be a little bit more losses, and, and you know, but it's like, it was actually quite a small battle. Um, but it was a rather cool battle, though. Brought some interesting strategy. Wow, look at that. Almost the entire army is just slave slingers. Huh. I'm guessing this is the one that actually shot me. Well, the Macedonians are dead, so... And that's pretty much the death of the uh, Macedonian... Or, or the Macedonian faction, I believe. So the Ardeidae, or whatever, they're still a thing. Oh, come on, don't kill my general. Please don't kill my general. Did you kill my general? I don't know if you killed my general. I guess we'll never know. Well, I'll see you when my turn ends. Oh! So never mind the whole turn ending thing. Um, yeah, sure, trade sounds fun. Let's go, go trade. I don't want to give you money though. So how about you do it like that instead? Nice. No need to give the enemy money. And here we are. And now we have a bunch of these messages, messages that we need to go through. So let's just start. A general increase in rank, understandable. Usually happens. Subversion. Okay. Assaulted the patrols of your settlement garrison, leaving many dead and more injured. Wow! Really? That's the fuckhead over here. I think it is him. Oh well. Alliance forged. Rome and Syracuse. I... Wow, okay, that's not very usual that you see that happening. Mastodon died, already mentioned. And my spy died, and all the women are crying. Oh well. He reached the end of his days. Uh, mission successful. Oh, hey! 60 units in total. We are given a bunch of money for that. Nice. Oh, wow, look at all the money. Holy shit! Uh, three. Viet. In. 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 Veniam. Viam. I shall find a way. A beloved ruler, dreaded subjugator, builder of cities, destroyer of civilizations. There are many paths to glory. Which will you take? Hold at least one settlement in 11 individual provinces. Okay, talking about that kind of stuff, do we even have any, like, specific missions right now? I don't think we have. Nope, no missions was given that day. We have a bunch of these things, though. Oh, despite customs, the Ptolemaic dynasty were still Hellenic foreign rulers. Some civil unrest might have been avoided if the pharaohs had consolidated their hold in northeast Africa rather than constantly making war against other, the other successors, so... Ah, uh, Ethiopia. That's, uh, that's Ethiopia. That's down here. But I don't want to take that, though, so never mind. We're, not gonna, we're never going to do this mission. Friend of Rome. But I... No, I'm going to have to invade Rome at some point, so I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> the subjugation of Seleus Seleucia. Wow. Ward in... Uh, yeah, unfortunate... Dynastic and domestic problems hampered Egypt's efforts. Without these, the pharaoh may have crushed the Seleucidic Empire by the early 2nd century BC. Hmm. Well, that's today's history lesson, and that's about all you are going to get for this episode. So, yeah, thanks so much for watching this episode of Let's Play Total Rome 2 as Egypt. I uh, hope you've enjoyed, and until next time, bye.